My mom left when I was 12, and haven't been in contact since and now she called to meet up. My, 23M, mother, 42F, got pregnant with me when she was 19 and at 21 she got pregnant with my little sister. She was always distant towards us and would always rather go out with her friends instead of spend time with me and my sister. I remember one time my mom got really angry at us because we ruined her life and said she never wanted us. Our father would always get angry at her and that would end up in them getting in a big fight. When that would happen I'd always take my sister to my room and make sure she didn't pay attention to it. When I was 12, things changed and that is also when my mom decided to leave to be with one of her exes. Our father tried to get her to visit or even call so that we could see or hear her voice but she never did and up until a week ago I hadn't heard from her. So a week ago I got a call from an unknown number, I pick up and it is my mom. I was surprised and when I asked her how she got my number she told me my aunt, her sister, gave it to her. She told me that she was in town and wanted to meet with me and my sister. I told her that I wasn't interested in meeting with her because of what she did. She asked me to think about it to which I replied that I wouldn't and that she has to leave me and my sister alone. She didn't like this and got a little mad, she told me that if I did want to meet with her to give her a call or to text her and she hung up. After the call I immediately called my sister and told her what happened and she said she wanted to meet up with her. After explaining that I didn't want to she told me she understood and that she wouldn't go if I didn't want to. So now I don't really know what to do. My sister wants to meet up with her but I don't because I don't believe she deserves to see us after everything she has done and said to us and especially after leaving us, but I also want to give my sister the chance to get the answers she wants out of our mom. Sorry if it is a bit long I just wanted to get this out since it has been on my mind since it happened. Update. So me and my sister decided to meet up with our mom. My sister and I had a talk and we agreed to meet up with her but on the condition that it would be on our terms and she agreed. We agree on a time and place and when we arrive she is already there but not alone. We walk up to her and she hugs my sister and tries to hug me afterwards but I push her away, I'll admit that she looked hurt when I did. After a little bit she introduced us and the person with her was her husband. Her husband was a little weird but seems like a good guy. So we get to talking and my sister asks her a lot of questions which she answered. After a little while she explains why she wanted to meet with us and that is when we also find out that we have three younger siblings, two brothers and one sister and she wants us to meet them. This is where I got angry and went off on her but she accepted everything I said and even accepted everything I called her. Before we left our mom asked if we could meet up again and while my sister agreed to meet up, I told her I want to keep it to just calls and texts. She accepted it and we all left. My sister has been messaging with her a lot and has already made plans to meet our siblings next weekend. I was asked to go with her but I declined. I'm glad I got to talk to her and get some answers but besides just calling and texting I don't think I will have a relationship with her. I just don't see the reason for it. Top comment. I'm sorry she put you through that. What was her excuse to leave and not speak with you for over a decade? I will never understand or have any compassion for parents that leave their children. My husband was abandoned at age 6 and it makes my blood boil. He has tried to get answers and has siblings but his father refuses to let him speak to them, and they won't respond to him when he reached out as well. All I know is it has made him the best father anyone could ask for. He has broken a generational curse. Second comment. So her excuse was something that really effing hurt. She just didn't want to be our mom. She did say that after a while she started regretting leaving us and that she wanted to get in contact but she was scared and ashamed. Your husband is a strong man and I'm glad he was able to break that curse. Third comment. She didn't want to be your mom, but she had no problem being a mom to your three younger siblings? That's honestly hurtful. I'm sorry you had to hear that. Please subscribe to our channel, thanks for watching.